Following up tonight, a local children's choir now looking for a new home after their host church voted to close its doors for good this Sunday. The choir only moved into that new space earlier this year. ABC 15's Josh Cristianto has their story and the next steps. The Phoenix Children's Chorus used to performing at big venues, but this is where home is. I've had a lot of memories of this place and it's just been amazing here. Central United Methodist Church off North Central and East McDowell generously opened their reception space for the choir to practice. But late April, because of declining membership, the church voted to close down, leaving the young choristers with nowhere to go. We had just negotiated a three-year lease. <laughs> And a couple of weeks later, the pastor called and said, unfortunately, the church isn't going to make it. For a lot of kids, this is kind of their safe space. This is an outlet for them that they don't normally get to do um, elsewhere, and especially in schools as arts programs are starting to dwindle a little bit. PCC has been around for 40 years now. It started with 30 kids. Now it's over 350. They outgrew their spaces at the Phoenix Center for the Arts and moved into the church only this year. Now they're looking for a new place to hit that high note and sing the melodies that have made them all close. It's really just grown into a place that we look forward to going to every week. It's become, you know, people that we see outside of rehearsals, you know, friends that we've made. Choir is something you, you can't do by yourself. You have to be a part of something bigger than yourself to, to be successful. It'll be up to the community to keep the music playing for generations to come. Josh Cristiano, ABC 15, Arizona. Josh.